Um, yeah, I think, you know, it was a frustrating game throughout it. You know, I thought we had every chance to win that game. Uh, I thought we, also we had a number of times in the game we had, we had opportunities to run away with it, uh, especially early in the game, having that 14-point lead. And they hadn't really moved the ball on our D and starting with that fake punt. I think after that, you know, I feel like he went like eight of his next 10 or something like that. So that got him back in the game uh, there at the end. Um, a couple, you know, we want to go in and score on that drive. Obviously, a touchdown. We ended up getting a field goal. I believe it made it two scores. Um, but then they went right down and answered with a field goal. I uh, thought we had a chance to make it a two-score game. We ended up missing that field goal. And then I think they got a bomb where they went down there right away. They didn't even make them really work for it. They got a big chunk. Got behind their defense too much today. Um, gave them some easy ones in that way. And um, you saw what happened then. Um, just how disappointing of a loss that was. Um, you know, I, I knew everyone was pissed um, without them having to tell me, and we should be. When, when you have a game like that where you feel you have every chance to win and you don't get it done, uh, those are the ones, those are usually the more disappointing ones. Um, every, all three phases had their doing that. Um, but there was also times that uh, a phase could take over and not even allow it to come to something. And, and I told them last night, you got to take their hope away. Um, you give Stafford too much hope and you give them, give, put the ball in his hands at the end. Um, that's not a situation you want to be in. And we had every chance to avoid that situation a number of times. And we came up short. Juwan was unbelievable. I mean, I think the numbers show it, but more than the numbers, just um, he, he was he was a warrior the whole game. He's always like that, got a lot more opportunities today and um, was automatic on every single one. And even some bad looks um, when I didn't know if the ball should go there. Um, it, you quickly saw after it that they weren't they weren't going to take that away from Juwan. And um, he was very inspiring today, how he played. Um, yeah, I mean, it's pretty high, you know, with all of us and the standard that we have of, you know, obviously winning and closing out games and, um, you know, when you got a 14 point lead, obviously, um, you know, anything can happen. But for us, it's like, all right, we have the momentum. Um, let's run with it. You know, we have a good enough team to, to finish out a game, you know, pretty early and, and, and put up points, um, every drive, you know, offensively. So, um, you know, we're all pretty frustrated. Um, so we just got to watch the film, get better from it. And, um, you know, we win and lose as a team. There's, everyone has their moments. But, um, man, more than anything, I just feel like it's, it comes down to complimentary football, man. You know, once defense gets a stop, we have to score. And we have to be hard on ourselves with that. And, um, you know, just, just everything all together tied in. So it's four quarters of that. You know, you miss out an opportunity and give the other team life. Um, it's the NFL, man. They're, the other guys on the other side are really good. And, and uh, they'll make you pay for it. So we had to learn the hard way today. He's a dog, man. Uh, absolutely love Juwan. Um, it's the way he comes in every day and, and then brings energy to our offense, man, with some huge plays and sparks energy and just his love for the game, man. You can see it and you feel it when you're on the field with him. So um, absolutely love that guy. I'll go to war with him any day of the week.